Hey guys, it's Carrie. I'm looking at awesome African animals. Lion, they are known for being ferocious and vicious, especially when hungry or provoked. Also, they are afraid of large mammals like giraffes, hippos and elephants. Every time they hunt, there is an element of fear. With reproduction, the male follows the female at all times, often resting with her. He may lick her neck, back or genital area, which is uncommon behaviour outside of courtship. The female invites copulation by lordosis, a reflexive behaviour in fellows. When lions mate, the male lion mounts the female and bites her neck to make her passive. Lions copulate many times over the four-day estrus period. Like those of other cats, the male lion's penis has spines that point backwards. During withdrawal of the penis, the spines wreck the walls of the female's vagina to stimulate ovulation. Please subscribe and turn on notifications. The hippo has a powerful jaw. The jaw hinge is located far enough back to allow the animal to open its mouth at almost 180 degrees. Their skeletal structures are graphoportal, adapted to carrying their enormous weight and their specific gravity allows them to sink and move along the bottom of a river. Despite being semi-aquatic and having webbed feet, an adult hippo is not a particularly good swimmer, nor can it float. It is rarely found in deep water. When it is, the animal moves by porpoise-like leaps from the bottom. During the daytime, herds prefer to sleep in shallow water or occasionally on a mud bank grouped closely together. Hippos emerge from water at dusk and go ashore to feed. They graze on grassy areas along the banks of the water. Giraffe Roaming giraffes quite often get struck by lightning and die. When it enters the neck, around 30,000 amps of energy surges through the body, singeing fur and causing the heart to beat itself to death. The only significant predators of giraffes are lions and they will always look for the young and the weak giraffes first. Despite its long neck and legs, the giraffe's body is relatively short. They are able to close their muscular nostrils to protect against sandstorms and ants. Plain zebra or Bertel zebra live in the treeless grasslands and woodlands in Africa. Their stripes are especially wide becoming wider and more horizontal towards the flanks and rear of the body. They grow to 2.5 metres in length with tail lengths up to 56 centimetres. At the shoulder they are up to 1.45 metres tall and weigh up to 385 kilograms. Greavy zebra is the largest of the equids and has a long head and neck and slender legs. Their vertical stripes are much narrower. Quagga, it was a yellowish brown zebra with stripes only on its head, neck and forebody. It looks similar to the okapi and went extinct in 1883. Cape Buffalo African buffalo can inhabit practically any habitat with permanent water and grass. 
It is a very robust species. Its shoulder height is up to 1.7 meters and its head and body length is up to 3.4 meters and the tail can grow just over one meter. Compared with other large bovids, it has a long but stocky body and short but thick set legs resulting in a relatively short standing height. They can weigh up to 1,000 kilograms. African Wild Dog, also called Cape Hunting Dog or Hyena Dog. This wild African carnivore differs from the rest of the members of the dog family Canada in only having four toes on each foot. Its length is up to just over one meter with a 41 centimeter tail maximum. Dromedary or Arabian camel to attract females. The males splash their urine on their tails and nether regions. They also extrude their soft palate. The male gurgles and copious amounts of saliva turns to foam and covers the mouth. Copulation starts with the male sniffing and biting at the female. The male forces the female to sit and grasps her with his forelegs. The male usually ejaculates three or four times within a single mating session. Camelids are the only ungulates to mate in a sitting position. Dharma gazelle is now extinct in North Africa but survives in small numbers in the Sahel, south of the Sahara. Adex, which is now extinct in the wild. Barbary stag, it is the only extant deer known to be native to Africa. The Barbary stag has had predators like the Barbary lion, the atlas bear and the Barbary leopard but they have either become extinct or are endangered. Please stay and watch another video with me. I love to read your comments. Thank you for watching my video. See you again soon. See you guys in my next video.